Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for June 15th of 2024 is titled Prominences and Filaments on the Active Sun. So what do we see here? Well, this is an image of the sun taken a month ago and actually multiple images put together looking at hydrogen emission. So the sun being made mostly of hydrogen has relatively strong hydrogen emission. And that's one way to really see a lot of detail in the sun. And that's because we're looking at just one specific wavelength of hydrogen instead of looking at across the entire spectrum. Now here we see very specific features known as prominences and filaments. Now what's the difference between a prominence and a filament? Really not much. They're essentially the same thing just viewed from a different perspective. The filaments we see stretching across the sun here are the same as the prominences seen on the limb of the sun. It's just that when we see the prominences on the limb, they're against the backdrop of space and they stand out and we can see them very clearly against the dark space behind them. The filaments on the other hand are against the surface of the sun and we don't get that image of them rising up over the surface but they would look just the same if you looked from a slightly different perspective and were able to look at them from another region another area where you would be seeing them against the limb of the sun. Now they are regions where material has been lifted off the sun's surface in this case in a relatively gentle manner and is raining back down on the surface here. Now this was part of an image taken near the middle of last month uh, shortly after the time of all of the solar activity that occurred by that massive sunspot group known as AR 3664. And in fact, we can see some of the remnants of that here just off to the edge of the image. And in fact, if you look at about the four o'clock position here, there is a large solar uh, prominence there that was also associated with some very strong solar flares that were emitted that same day. Now the sunspot group itself is no longer visible from this angle it's rotating off the edge of the sun and of course we know it came back around about a few weeks later and became visible on the other side of the sun. The sunspot groups move with the sun as it rotates. So as the sun rotates about once every month, a little bit less than that, then it will come or they will come around again. However, sunspots often only last one cycle of the sun, one trip around, or maybe a little bit more or even less, but they don't last a very long period of time. We don't generally see the same sunspot group for months and months on end. Sun, sun, sunspots will come and go over time as we see see them, but we will still see the same general structures like the filaments and prominences that we see today. Now this is the active sun. What does that mean? It means the sun is at the peak of its activity. So we're going to see a lot more prominences, a lot more uh, filaments and a lot more solar flares and coronal mass ejections because of the much more active sun that is occurring right now at the peak of its 11 year cycle. So that was our picture of the day for June 15th of 2024. It was titled prominences and filaments on the active sun. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be how to destroy a star. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone. And I will see you in class.